Hey everybody, what's going on? And in today's video, we're gonna be covering the onboarding process for eXp Realty in six easy steps. Now, this video might be a little boring for you, especially if you're not with eXp Realty already, um, but I've been growing my team fast here, and so I wanted to make a little video about the onboarding process because it can be a little uh, overwhelming for people as these emails start coming in so we're gonna get right to it right now but first of all I'm going to dive into my computer here in about five seconds and we're gonna get I'm gonna show you like where to go to sign up and get the whole process started first and foremost uh, but before that if this is the very first time you've ever been to this channel uh, hit the subscribe button hit the little bell icon uh, in that way you're notified whenever I release a new video because I'm always releasing videos on tips and tricks on how to grow your real estate business through digital marketing. It's something that I've been doing for about the past 10 to 15 years. Anyways, and give it a thumbs up too and give it a thumbs down if you don't like it because that helps me create content for you and no matter what kind of feedback I get, it helps me grow. So. Anyways, I'm going to dive into our into my computer, like I said, and I'm going to show you exactly where to go to get started. All right. So, when you first start the whole process to get uh, to join EXP, there's a couple different ways to start the process. First, you can go to uh, join.exprealty.com and you can start filling out the application there, but whoever's responsible for introducing you to eXp Realty has their own link to get started. It's usually their first name, uh, last name, dot exprealty.com, just like the website you see right here. And then up in the right-hand corner, there's gonna be, I have mine customized a little bit, so I have like, a few different things but right here usually there's going to be a button that says join exp realty with whoever is responsible for introducing you to the company now what it takes you to is this page right here and you can click apply as an agent just like that okay and then that's going to take you to this very first page and this is where you're going to start filling out your information. Um, put in an email address here that you pay attention to and that you get the emails because you're going to be getting uh, a few different emails as the process goes on. I'm also going to be linking in the, in the show notes an onboarding checklist. And it's, it kind of walks you through the entire process as well. So that's going to look just like this. So it's going to look just like this right here. It's going to be a uh, U.S. EXP onboarding checklist. I mean, unless you're watching this video in like Brazil or Canada, um, Mexico, fr France even. EXP is in France now. That's crazy. We're opening up Israel. That's nuts as well. So if you're watching this video from any of those other countries, which maybe you are, I don't know, uh, make sure it, you have the right onboarding, onboarding checklist. And if you need help getting it, just reach out to me. Shoot me a, a message either here on uh, YouTube or find me on any of my social media accounts. I'll leave all the links to all my social media accounts down below too. If follow me on those as well. So what's gonna happen first is like, just like in uh, on this uh, onboarding checklist. So you're gonna go to that website, just like I said, and then that still does not determine who you name as your sponsor, okay? So just because say you started the application on my website, uh, just like we, I just showed you, that does not mean that you are going to be linked to me. When you're filling out the application, it's going to say, who is your sponsor? And that's where you're going to put in my name or whoever's name is responsible for bringing you to eXp Realty. 
So the next step, just like on this onboarding guide says, is if you stop for any reason and you need to come back to it, you can go to this website right here, joinapp.exprealty.com forward slash SSO, and that's where you can continue your application process. It's a, it takes about 15 minutes at the very most to complete the, the application and the ICA agreement. And once you do that, you send it off and the team starts reviewing it and they start looking at it, making sure that the things are right on there. Um, if they have any questions, they're gonna reach out to you. And as long as you filled out everything correctly, so step three is going to be, you're going to receive an email and in that email subject line, just like in this email says, it's gonna say copy of your independent contractor agreement. So that's gonna be on the subject line right there. And that's just gonna be a copy of, well, your ICA agreement. I say download it, print it, put it in a folder so that you always have it to review. So step four is going to be where you transfer your license over to EXP and EXP accepts your license. They reach out, they take it, um, and they put it over at EXP. You also usually, depending on your state, have to reach out to your state board and you have to transfer your license physically as well. And um, in certain states that can cost like maybe 10 bucks to do that at the very, that, that's the most I've seen it cost. So that may have an additional charge on top of the 149 that you're gonna be charged at the beginning of, well, you're not charged until the process is all done, but you'll fill out that information in your application. Everybody's charged at 149 their first month, and that's just, that includes your $85 for the very first month for the tech fee, and it includes the processing fee for everything. And you also get a thousand business cards for free and get some folders for free as well. So once you receive that email, open it up. There's gonna be instructions in there and the instructions could vary depending on your state, but you'll usually reach out to your state broker and ask them how the process goes or the onboarding person, whoever's email or contact information is inside that email. Every state is a little different. If you need help with this, reach out to me. I can. I can reach out to everybody in the company and I can take a look at that for you. Once you've transferred your license to EXP, your EXP passport will be active. You'll be able to log in, but you're not quite done yet. You will not be officially with EXP Realty until you activate your, your email address. So that's gonna be the next email that comes and that email, uh, the subject line in that email is going to be activate your EXP Realty email address. Once that's active, you're officially with EXP. Congratulations, and you're gonna receive these three emails right here with these three subject lines. Now, they're gonna say welcome email is gonna be subject, welcome to EXP Realty, your passport account. So this is gonna be how you log into your, your dashboard. You're gonna, um, more than likely, this is how this is how you get logged into EXP World as well. You're going to want to download the EXP app onto your phone because no matter where you are, you can log into that that app and you can listen to whatever trainings are going on that day. So, say you're driving from appointment to appointment, or you're out grocery shopping, and you really wanted to hear how to cold call or how to do digital marketing, and they have a class on this. You wanna know how to sell a thousand homes a year, whatever it is, you can log in from your app and just listen to it on the phone. So make sure you download that after all this is done. That's kind of like a, I don't know, step eight, I guess, <laughs> or step seven. So the next email is going to be activate your EXP Realty Skyslope account. Skyslope is where we upload all our documents from our transactions. So this is very important to activate your Skyslope account. It's really easy to use Skyslope. I, do, I did do a video about how to use Skyslope. And if you need to, when that time comes, come on back, watch that video, and you'll be all set there. It's really easy to, to use. And then you're gonna get your email to order your thousand business cards for free right there. If you need recent, reach out to trans, uh, transitions or yeah, transition staff. 
So that's all the steps one through six on how to onboard with eXp Realty. Again, this is going to be, there's gonna be a link to this document in the show notes. And again, I'm always here to help anybody. It doesn't matter if you named me as your sponsor or not, um, but I'm here for you. All right, have an awesome week, guys. Sell a ton of homes. Welcome to eXp.